Hey guys, this is Shamik and Shamtech HD, and in this video, I'm going to be doing a pretty quick speed comparison between Mozilla Firefox 25 and Google Chrome 31. So in the, the first test I conducted was a SunSpider benchmark, which tests how fast browsers load web pages, and in this, Google Chrome got a score of 370.2 milliseconds, and Firefox got a score of 498.5 milliseconds. So the winner here is clearly Google Chrome, as it can render web pages quicker. The next test I did was the hardware acceleration test, which is pretty much how well the browser can use the GPU to render graphics. And in here, Google Chrome got a measly 3 FPS with no settings change, and Mozilla Firefox got a slightly better but still bad 16 frames per second. So the winner here is also, well, no, it's actually not also, but it is Mozilla Firefox. The next test I did is the HTML5 test, which tests how well a browser can render HTML5, which is pretty, which is on a lot of websites, and Google Chrome got a score of 501, while Mozilla Firefox got a score of 442. So here, Google Chrome scored a lot better than Firefox, which means the websites would look how they're supposed to be displayed better on Google Chrome than on Firefox, but I have yet to find any websites that have actually not been rendered on Firefox right. So the final verdict really comes down to the type of PC you have and what you do. So if you have a, you know, a mid-range or even a high-end PC, Google Chrome is probably the best option for you. Because both of these browsers really perform very well when loading up web pages, but Google Chrome, as you saw in the SunSpider and HTML5 tests, does perform better, significantly better, which means it would be faster. But on a higher end device, you're not going to be able to see the difference that much. But when it comes to HTML5, you would. So I'd say if you're on a mid range or high end PC, Google Chrome 25, pff, no, Google Chrome 31, my bad, is the way to go. On the other hand, if you're on a low end device, then Mozilla Firefox may suit your needs. Even if you have to sacrifice maybe a few seconds, maybe a second or two in speed, rend like speed when it comes to loading websites, you're going to get a smoother experience on Firefox when playing Flash games or scrolling up and down websites because of that hardware acceleration by default. Now, you can definitely turn on some settings in Chrome that will allow you to turn on hardware acceleration. So this is definitely an option if you use Google services or synced in with Google Chrome. So yeah, there you have it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching this quick video. Lastly, I loaded up a pretty graphical website called lifehacker.com that I did not contribute in any way on both Firefox and Chrome, which you can see here. And as you can see, they both loaded very quickly on a relatively low-end device, so you probably will not see much of a difference. So whichever browser you pick, you're not going wrong. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe, and thanks for watching this video.